guys on this journey which has been so amazing for me. Haha, ha, I will see you on the other side. Namaste. Hydro, we will be having our first in person retreat for my module two of my mindfulness course that I'm doing through Seven Bosch. So, this is the Hydro. I'm going to be doing a quick tour for everyone. Hydro Seven Bosch. This is what the entrance looks like as you walk in. I love the water feature. I can read, if you know me, you know, obsessed with water. This is the entrance of the place. That it's quite open space and inviting. Um, over here, people. Oh, these are. Look, I'm passing them. So each and every one of us, as part of it, have to do the COVID. So this is the tool. It's a self test that everybody does for themselves. So we're at the hydro. Finally arrived at our retreat spot. It is quite, quite, quite cool. My room is my team. I'm taking you there for the Paranjim and Koti. I will show you guys my luggage. Welcome to my home for the next four days. This is the Hydro Spa Retreat Centre. Room. Quite lovely. The bathroom area. Mm. Kind of ancient Nana. But I love the duality of the bath. And there's the mirror. Who am I to mask when I'm indoors? Go see him. I packed like a body. Look at this bag. Here's another bag. And a whole hiking bag. Packed, packed, packed to capacity. Oh. <laughs> like, I was so busy. I've already checked in. Name tag on Gogo. And I was thinking of changing, but now I can't. I can actually. Oh. We've gone through a load. Already done a rapid COVID test. No corona formed against us will block our way. Quite lovely. What I love the most about it immediately is this. Maybe let us step outside. And so we're stepping outside. And this is literally it in Wineland, capital of the whole of Africa, Stellenbosch. So this is the view that I get to experience every day for the next couple of days. I will do a whole tour. That's the pool area. How oh, lovely. Is me. Hello. I love these shades by the Black Hatter. I am him. Definitely. Flowers. I don't even know where I'm headed right now, so I'm literally self touring. So, this is the dining area. Hello. Woo, hello. How are you? I'm good, how are you? I'm good. I'm doing a tour and a vlog of the place, so oh. I'm just taking everything in. This place is so okay. beautiful. Okay. Thank you. So, 
if I go down that side. Yes, okay, so this way is the lounge. Yes, this is the lounge. Okay, yeah, and is the is the anywhere where they sell alcohol here? No. <laughs> Sorry. I thought there was no alcohol. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> yes. Kanya. Kanya. Yes. Okay. yes. Okay. So let's carry on doing the tour. This is the lounge area. Lounge, lounge, lounge. Ooh. Look at that. And here I am. But then look. <laughs> oh, wow. Mindfulness, they teach us about the contradictory nature of life. And this is the biggest lesson on it. At the entrance, no electric equipment. And what do you find? Just that. So I think this is where the practice room because I see mats here, with some yoga, towels. This is beautiful. So this is downstairs still. The meditation room, the practice room, the lounge. Okay. Abanganje, senita ka koko, segunje. Hi, a city nige in shame. Now I'm going outside to go to my favorite place, Gamanzan. Here's my shorty. Oh, I come at, I'm giving my YouTubers a tour of the place. <laughs> like I am vlogging. <laughs> so this is the pool. Everyone is <laughs> okay. I won't put you guys. Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you. This is what I love about our group is that like, this is such a kind gesture. Like, like to show everyone her the name on the oh. so, so I forgot to vlog before I destroyed my face. Yeah, you like the influencer Gabo. The influencer Gabo. You've got to marry. Day two has started and already I was late. I woke up at seven. I couldn't vlog last night because. Every time, like, after we finish the evening session, we go into silent retreat. I went to the gym for a bit of a gym session. And when I got back, I got locked out. I'm having some of my protein shake now. It's a really breakfast, so I will eat today. The beauty of this place. So otherworldly. Where is the job? It's right here. How was it, guys? It's a nice job. It's very quaint. Very, very quaint. But it has all the. Mental intention for this practice. Perhaps intention of. Being with whatever you find is exactly as it is. Being with. Perhaps an intention of holding whatever you're experiencing with an enormous sense of kindness and gentleness. Now I've found friends. 
We're going to meet by the hot pool because <laughs> we have a break until the next session at four and we're going to smoke some <laughs> bro some mm. no i'm just saying that come on, like we have space for like kind of running stuff like right. small group stuff i definitely think it would be amazing because I really do want to find a way to sort of broaden my thing and ultimately I'd love to live in Cape Town. I mean, and I mean, it's also like a different, you also in Cape Town you want to like be tapped into different social mm. groups? I, I, and the, in your know, that I love the most, you know, I love diversity. Mm. You, that's where any sort of two learnings that have already taken form. Mm -hmm. for the other guys look this there you go. fresh off this fruit everywhere growing here Nancy. Nancy. oh it's so great yeah walk into the forest sunset well just after sunset this is the view these are my gangins my mind for squat aren't you tempted to climb this thing Oh my gosh, we should so climb I it. I really want to climb it. Oh, I want to climb it. Mm, I'm heading back to my room to take a quick power nap for all of 20 minutes before we head back in my land, Stellenbosch, at the Hydro. you know aesthetic value of it well, who doesn't want a hot boy summer or hot girl summer but it's the sitting with being intentional and purposeful around committing to something and how when you bring the body into it it becomes something that speaks to you you know, I can feel it in my body when I haven't worked out and just carries through and drags and drags and drags. So grateful to have found my way back home to gym. Singing again and yet. Last night I had locked myself out. <laughs> Amazing.
moment. Yeah, but it's like what moon? I'll taste it. Are you not having any of it? I'll have some of this one. This don't matter, it's practice. I don't find like they cook or anything. Yeah, it's like when you don't get like enough. So we're going to have a session with John Cabotson. I don't know. Deesha, only going to bed now. It's like almost half past twelve. I'm going to But we had so much fun shooting with the squadron. Yo, <laughs> the chat, the quality of the conversation. Amaze. Amaze. And tonight the moon also <laughs> didn't want to make an appearance till now. Hello, great goddess. Good morning. Uh -huh. oh. My poor container has got squashed from the packing. And it's quite important to see. You see, we must have ways in which we can support ourselves. And sometimes that way is in calling upon the gift set that we need to be. No longer move down with the pink water is there to make the things happen in your life, you know, in fact, that slack and what, what, what. But also just from an ethno-medicinal point of view, because the swasho is made from ash, and, you know, ash is a fertilizer, it's a neutralizer. Whenever it is winter and it's at the end and the windy season starts and there are fires, there's fires all over those mountains that rage and burn, burn and burn and burn, and all of that ash and soot goes and fertilizes the ground and allows for then when the rain comes and falls for things to actually <laughs> blossom. So when we use Iswash, it's understanding that that's a noble truth of ash and fire processes and the interaction with the soil. And we are of the soil, so we call upon that connection. And that's literally what I feel like, because yesterday I did go through the dark night of the soul. I went through feeling like I was in winter where in the first hour of practice, I nearly was like, oh, oh, fuck it, yeah, but logo. So to neutralize and to do all of that, definitely bluish hue, which I love. Blue is my color. I can't wait to dip inside. I'm going to give it a couple of moments to just really settle for all of the different components and then I will come and settle inside Nepat Levi and Galitika. This is like an indoor heated pool. Yeah. Bruh, get into it. Ooh. <laughs> and the mountain behind there. 
Barbara, one of our amazing teachers. Leaving our retreat, this was a beautiful, beautiful like <laughs> thing. I don't even have words for it. 